Hello everybody, Kiwi24000 here. Welcome to episode 53 of Super Paper Mario in the last episode. We were sent here to the underwear. Dooby dooby doo. Oh me, I wonder if I shall meet my most special someone this day. Surely is the Prince of Countess Fair, pining even now to meet me. Quickly, my loving prince, fly to me. Ah. <clears throat> Pray, what call hast thou to stare at me so? Didst thou hear me pine for an old mustachioed fatty be gone? Well, I can't even talk about this. Well, let's just flip past her then. Oh god, god, god. So here we are in the underwear. The underwear is a spooky place. It's pretty, pretty, um, uh, uh, menacing, I would say. Yes, and there's a lot of, uh, it, it's a big place, it's a very big place, and we don't have any of our partners or pixels, so we're all alone, kind of sucks here, everyone's been spending a lot of time here, even before chapter 7 starts, and yes, unfortunately, chapter 7 is the underwear, it kind of pissed me off when I heard that, but yeah, chapter 7 is in this place, Kind of sucks, I know. But oh well. Look at this guy. He, he looks like someone from like a, 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 I don't know, a Capcom game or something. So basically, what you can do is, you, if you talk to him, you can ride across the river twigs in a boat. And yeah, this is the river twigs. Yeah, I know, river twigs, river sticks. Oh god. But what we actually want to do, um, is go over here, and, uh, <clears throat> wow, this is a long, okay, there we go, and we want to talk to, um, uh, Queen Jades, and, uh, she's in here, I think, yeah, she is, okay, you know, these dudes, the Shades, and the Gremlin Men, and this is obviously Queen Jade's. Who else would it be? You. What business have you with me? I'm Queen Jade, mistress of the underwear, ruler of those with ended games. Here in this place, your sins from your time among the li living are way. If your sins are light enough, the bliss of the over there will be yours. But if not, you suffer for eternity among the game over. You also weigh your sins. Hmm? I sense a strange energy. Have you brought something strange into the underwear by chance? Yeah, Mario, you really needed to think about that. Ugh, whatever. What is this? No, no, it could not be, but how? It is badly damaged, yes, but why you hold a pure heart? We knew this. Who exactly are you to have a pure heart, and what has happened to it? Oh, wait, that's my phone. What the? Who knew they'd have cell phones that have been in between dimensions? What is it now, Grams? You know I'm working. What? Love Bee is missing? Oh, Mercy, I understand. Yes, I'll see to it. Hmm, bye. Just great. Just what I need. You were really just what I needed. <laughs> oh, perhaps you can help. Nah. Uh, what I received just now is from the king of the over there, Granby. One of the Nimbus vanished from the over there, and he asked me to look for her. Well, I cannot abandon my duties here in the palace. Am I too bad or all of this? Uh, excuse me. So much fault to you. Will you search for this missing person? Right? Oh, whatever. Thank you. Yeah. Love B. Mario. Oh, Mario, wait. Hold on to this pure while you're so busy searching. Because it's only if you have levitating powers. We're not. Just, I just want to look. I will return it when you return with Love B. And this place, allow me to give you this. A door key. So we should tr I was trying to skip that, but basically we need to check the river twigs and not get munched up by those hand guys. So let's go. The hand people. I mean, those wall masters in Zelda. If I remember, ow. Okay, Mario should be dead. Not only should he run out of air, but the pressure should be killing him right now. 
Okay, these sounds, I say, they kind of make me want to, like, choke somebody. What the? Do I have to... F oh, I flew I flew into 3D, I think. Indeed, I do. Can't get me now, suckers. Woo! Alright, this is the door it unlocks. If we can just escape this freaky, eerie music, then I'm, I'm fine with that. And look, more water stuff, but this time we don't have Bowser. So we, we pretty much just need to avoid everything. Hell. Let me get this pipe. If I can. I can. Okay. Do I have to push this? Yeah, I do. I do have to push this. Okay, so we just need to break those and then hit this again. Okay, I'm not sure. I really don't like the underwear. Chapter 7's also in the underwear. Yeah, I guess it's kind of a spoiler. Which is why it's my least favorite chapter in the game. Because it's not that fun. Alright, so you want to flip me a 3D and go through this like sewer tunnel type thing? Oh jeez. Okay, so we can't hit those blocks underwater, so that's why we need to switch to the water level. Okay. What do I do? I just um hit this, the, then the water will change, and then do I go into a pipe? I think you could go into pipes. Ooh, whatever. Or do I still have a 3D here? Something I'm missing? Because you know, a place like this is always going to be like a secret in 3D. And oh, do I go into here? No. Uh, oh, maybe there's, the, it, oh, it's probably that block that I couldn't hit, that I need, I need to hit now. Yeah, it is. Oh, wait, no, that's like a, uh, uh, what? The heck did that do? We didn't do anything. Um, uh, maybe if I turn the water on, well, let's see what happens. See, look, look at these puzzles. It's annoying. To say the least. Okay. <clears throat> no. Or do I? No, that wouldn't make sense. I don't know. I'm confused. Dazed and confused. We'll turn the water back off then. And, um. I guess you guys want to figure out what to do. Alright, so if you've only 3D here, we're just testing some stuff, and I found that there's this passage here. And there's a pipe and a door. I do believe we want to go into the door first. And if you jump down here, I, if I remember, yes, there is a chest with, I think, a card. I would prefer like a super, uh, super shroom shake or something. And we have to do water platforming and it pushes you up the sides ever so. Mm. Oh boy, how I end up in this stinky place. Complex underlink grab me. I remember that and then and then it's Luigi. Oh uh, well, I don't forget. I just wish someone could come help me. Playing a Mr. L theme and it's Luigi. 
Oh, uh, the bro. Oh yeah, I missed you, bro. Oh. What? Huh? Why am I here? Well, I don't exactly know. What? The underwear of the land of ended games? What are you saying? What does this all mean? Well, we got Luigi. That's good. Uh huh. Okay, I got you. So my game's over. Great. It's handling it quite well. This is one of Cowboy's baddies when I must have done me in, right? Just like you guys, huh? Well, everybody runs out of extra life sometime, right? So what should we do now? Oh, uh, get the hell out. Oh, yeah, find Love Bee. Love Bee, you're looking for someone named Love Bee? Hey, sounds good to me. I'm looking for free time after all my game's over. So. This looks like a job for Luigi. So. Is there anything else? No, okay, there's not. So with Luigi, he can't flip just like all the other characters. But if you hold down and then release it, he can do a super jump and go to high distances. So that's how we're gonna want to go about getting up here. All right. And now we want to go to the pipe, I think. I like Luigi. Um, he's probably my favorite of the three other unlockable characters. And Luigi's is just awesome overall. I'm only hitting these because I hope there's going to be a healing item in one of them. The problem is it's the same problems as in Super Mario Galaxy and stuff. And um, sometimes when you want to go sideways, he'll go down. But that's just like a uh, fault of hitting the button. But it's still kind of annoying. But overall, I still like him as a character. He's pretty awesome. All right, so we need to, of course, right after we get Luigi, we have to go back to Mario. And I'm constantly changing the volume. So let's uh, see which one would be better. And Gary, I have to go turn the water back on. Fantastic. 